Good morning. I'm Dan Hamby, the president of Tahiko Engines Corporation, which has developed technologies to create the next generation of internal combustion engines. Based on two core patent-pending designs, our engine will offer improved performance with twice the fuel economy. Tahiko will license the technologies to manufacturers of all types of engines while focusing its manufacturing aimed at the motor freight truck industry, drawing on all available pallets. Tahiko expects to have certified engines on the road by the end of 2012. There are 8.5 million heavy-duty trucks in the U.S. In North Carolina, over 45,000. Within a 50-mile radius of Dehiko, there are 4,000 trucks. Each of these represents a great need to improve fuel economy, reducing operating costs. Our focus will be immediately on that 50-mile radius of Dehiko, relevant to a truck's age. Fuel consumes 28 to 38 percent of its operating cost. We will offer, by direct sale, a replacement engine installed through a network of service centers. The HECO has initiated talks with Salem Leasing to provide that network and, and lease option. Our engine's price reflects a return on investment that is very quick. For a company like BD&D, their return is eight months. For Salem, approximately 12 months. Locally, our market is $184 million, $2.1 billion on the state level, and over $390 billion nationally. To date, four companies have registered to take part in a beta road test program. These relationships will provide future orders, immediately generating revenues when our engine is released for sale. Our CVC I technology stands for constant volume combustion and intake, which is the mechanical means to precisely control the piston's movement, stopping it or dwelling at top dead center and bottom dead center, while a crankshaft continues to rotate for up to 90 degrees. The constant volume at bottom dead center provides an opportunity to fully charge the cylinder, obtaining 100% volumetric e efficiency. The dwell at top dead center provides time to precisely deliver fuel, creating peak pressure at the very moment that the crankshaft reaches maximum mechanical advantage. The CVCI design is three times more efficient our proof of concept prototype type has demonstrated a 350% improvement. Our Cohen cycle technology provides a mechanical means to allow all cycles to coincide within one revolution of the crankshaft while maintaining all of the advantages obtained by the CVCI design. It also provides the opportunity to overcharge the cylinder without the need of a supercharger. All this translates into an ultra-efficient spark or combustion ignition engine that is smaller, lighter, more powerful while consuming less fuel. Our modular design allows for a variety of, of custom assemblies taking a designer approach to supplying the customer's needs. I am the inventor of these technologies and the lead fringologist. Our advisory and board includes prominent scientists, businessmen, and professors like Dr. Ahmed Solomon, director of the North Carolina Motorsports and Automotive Research Center, and Mr. Randy Brooks, president of Hasco Incorporated, very respected manufacturer of machinery. DEC seeks $5 million to get to market through grants, investments, licensing, partnerships. Approximately 30 percent provides access to the Automotive Research Center, staff, and students. 30 percent is consumed by DEC's operation. 32 percent 
completes developments, the remaining 8% for capital and professional expenditures. Our market focus is small but sufficient for an excellent return on investment. We envision our growth to be substantial as word spreads about our product. We expect DeHeco to become an attractive acquisition as customers begin choosing to upgrade existing trucks instead of buying new. Forcing OEMs to consider our innovations. We are excited about our world changing technologies that clean the environment, extend oil reserves, and reduce oil dependency while offering savings to consumers of over $620 billion annually. We invite you to stop by our booth, number 707. Let's discuss the future. Thank you.